Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Mama Bear's Homestead and More. On today's episode, this is gonna be a good one, guys. Marty's heading to the field. But anyway, Papa Bear forgot to get some waters and make for a long day down there. No waters. So I gotta get water and we'll hit the road. guys we're checking our disc out checking bearings uh everything looks good uh like this tall grass it's hard to get chewed up but it's it's working on it guys the little disc doing good marty's doing good uh papa jerry's probably gonna be here in about uh 15 20 minutes and uh give me a ride back up to my truck so we can go get the fertilized buggy but um yeah so let's set this up and um maybe take you around ride on the disc
All right, guys, we got a fertilized buggy here, but we ha need to get all this disc at least once before we spread any fertilize. Uh, this is year we're using chemical fertilize. Uh, hopefully by next year, you know, we'll, we'll, I can make money, enough money farming that we can use cluckies because I believe it's better fertilized. But, um, all right, guys, it's time to get after it if the old tractor will start. Marty needed a drink, so did Bobby Bear. So I had unsweet tea, and Marty wants off road fuel. And this is an awesome funnel that locks into the tank. Alright guys, we were just tooling along, minding our own business, just disking away. All of a sudden, Marty shuts off. I guess when we put fuel in it, guys, we uh, knocked a bunch of stuff in the tank loose so it plugged up our tank plugged off our tank and we ran out of fuel oh that's not the bad part the bad part is i took this pipe plug here out to um to um see if i had fuel there of course you know it's empty there's i got fuel back but i dropped that plug and cannot find it anywhere um and, but luckily my buddy answered and he's gonna go get us one so we can get going um i was able to get some injectors uh crack loose and i got three three of them going bleeding so it might it might start but i don't want to try to start it until i get this plug here ah, i think one thing is 14 others but i mean it could have been worse the only thing i don't like is there's a good chance this is gonna happen again if uh if there's a lot of stuff in the tank I think, boys, we got this. It should fire right back up. Because four of the six injectors are wet, so that means that, that fuel running. Uh, but, um, yeah, we're just wait, sitting here waiting on, uh, parts i'll bring you guys back when we get going <laughs> if it ain't one thing it's 14 others i think i already said that but you guys know oh guys i made two rounds three rounds and ran it out of fuel again but there's something in the t 
I got trash in the tank or something. I don't know what it is. Um, I'm gonna uh, prime it back and keep fighting it for tonight, and then tomorrow I'll probably try to put a standpipe in the see if we can get it um, better for tomorrow. I mean, I'm not gonna run it tomorrow, but I'll work on it tomorrow. Um, uh, yeah, this uh, this is not not um, fair not very fa favorable but it's doing a great job look guys that's the first pass on it uh -huh. so let's see how fast we can unplug the fuel system don't drop the plug this time all right guys i don't know if you can hear that or not but it's bubbling because the fuel's coming from the tank into this filter through this line and it fills up and then it runs across into this filter and we got it opened up right there and this filter is what feeds the injection pump so as soon as we can get fuel coming out of here we'll plug that back up and All right, I can see fuel down in there. So it's filling this filter here up right now. And then when it gets it full, it'll bubble off the top. Then we've cracked all these injector lines. Did not crack that one because it's extremely hard to get to. And the, got the one on the end cracked. You can see fuel in there now, barely. Oh, it's gonna be a long. What what's gonna happen is I'm gonna try to get as much done tonight as I can, and then I need to take this down the road to a different farm. See. There it comes, guys. We're full there. All right. So, tighten that up so it don't bleed air. Don't leak air. All right. And we'll turn that injection pump on, keys on. Watch that injector, guys. <laughs> See, I can see stuff floating down. See uh, sediment in the bottom of the bowl there? I'll just clean that out a second ago. Alright, we got fuel back here. So we'll put that back on. Alright, here we go, guys. <laughs> So we can tighten it back up.
tighten it back up. It's got fuel to it. Kind of looks like number four got fuel to it too, but we'll go ahead and dump it and see where we're at. <laughs> Yeah, this is just a a process. Okay, that's good. We still have fuel there. So that's a good thing. I can see fuel running down it. So we got one and three closed and five. We're getting close, getting close, it's trying. Check our check. Make sure we still got fuel in the Had a little air there, so that was good. We got that out. So let's see if we can get it start. <laughs> let's close this fuel line here. That one's closed. That one's closed. That one's still open. <clears throat> My dad was, Papa Jerry was here, he'd be laughing. Man, he'd be laughing. Because back when I was a young fella, I run the D19 out of fuel every day, just about. <laughs> ah, close.
right, guys. That's a wrap for the, today. Uh, we got all of this disc for the first time. We got to move down to the other field. Uh, we still got to disc all that, and then we can spread fertilizer everywhere. And then we'll disc everything for the second time. Uh, but anyway, um, um, hit up our merch store. Um, like, subscribe, leave a comment. Um, all them things help the channel and as always my friends keep on keeping on because we love every single one of you and Jesus does too